loving every minute of it. But none more so than today, because yet again, the rookies come to the fore and Chaz Mostert oh, breaks through. What a win, what a fantastic story, and what an effort for Dick Johnson Racing. They replaced Will Davison with this kid in the number six car. He had some dramas in the first couple of events, but it came together at Pukekohe. Couple of podiums. Wow, Alan Moffat, Dick Johnson, John Bow, famous board names that have won at Barbagallo. Add Chaz Mostert to the list. Our 10th winner in 16 races, and Chaz Mostert wins for the first time. Um, for Ford yeah, Performance Racing, the second of his career, yeah, and he's beaten Lounds, Winterbottom, Wing Cup, all the big names. Yeah, Ooh, yeah, that builds the up. confidence. We've got another race winner. This is off the scale, off the scale as Wing Cup does everything he can. He had a three second margin, he blocks down the inside because he can. He comes away, and another whack, and Mostert goes through on the inside. This is huge in Australian motorsport. They've gone berserk at Ford Performance Racing. This kid is going to win this thing today and so is Paul Morris. Has not led a lap all day, Cropper. Not led a lap. Chaz Mostert is going to win with Paul Morris. Extraordinary motor race. Something you have never seen before. Chaz Mostert who's had 21 V8 supercar events and 56 previous races is going to make a very special name in history here. He is the winner of the Super Chief Auto Bathurst 1000. Moffat second. Second for James Moffat. And Nick Perkett makes it onto the podium. I'm out of breath. It's an unbelievable outcome. Davison fourth, then Wincup, then Winterbottom, then the Kelly's Todd and Rick. You can tell with the way he's driving the car to it, it's not easy. V8 supercar racing, we promise you, is not. But he makes it look easy. That's because the car's going so well. The team are doing a terrific job. He's gelling very well with his engineer. But well crucially, done, Chaz Great Mostert guy. is Good doing job. the job behind the wheel. No, uh, no burnout, no slides. Look after our tires, please. He takes it out. Race 10 of the championship at Winton goes to Chaz Mostert. His team boss, Tim Edwards, yesterday said he just let him reflect on it on his own. He asked him to do nothing different. He wanted him to keep the same approach, the same aggression in his racing. He deserves this victory. Nose clean, got a margin, great pace. Well done, Chaz Mostert. Well done, great drive. Mostert takes out race one of the Sky City Triple Crown here, and it's a one-two for the Pepsi Max crew. Rick Kelly home in third position. Just awesome stuff. Remember, he's been the man in qualifying terms, both at this venue and in the season so far. He's picked up nine podiums to date. This will be his tenth, and Mostert is about to add another one. In terms of the victories he's had in 2015. Awesome stuff from the Pepsi Max racer. Mostert wins on Sunday at the Coates Hire Ipswich Super Sprint. Craig Lowndes will be hugely encouraged by that second position. Brilliant, buddy. Brilliant drive. Awesome. That was great. We don't need these tyres anymore, mate, so you can have some fun. Chaz lights them up here at Queensland Raceway. Through turn eight for the final time for Mostert and Winterbottom. They locked out the front row. It seems certain to be a one-two finish for these guys. But third is another move in the right direction for the reigning champ, Jamie Wincup. And Lowndes doing his very best to minimise the damage. He's second in the title race right now, on course to finish fifth. Well done, buddy. Well done. Great drive. Awesome job. He is an absolute contender in this championship and proves it once again. Chaz Mostert wins the opener of the Sydney Motorsport Park Super Sprint. The story is this bloke rushing into championship contention. He climbed to second on the ladder yesterday. It was a masterful display well done, in changing well done, you conditions. Good job. It sure was a good job. Chaz Mostert takes out the final race of the Sydney Motorsport Park Super Sprint. He stepped it up, Chas Mostert. We know he's got the qualifying form. He has raced into championship contention. Mozzie is the man at Eastern Creek, Sydney Motorsport Park. Two corners remaining. He's let the margin slip back to Mark Winterbottom. He's backed away from it like Mark was suggesting. 
It's one corner remaining for Chas Mostert. 250 hard fought kilometres. And super yeah, cheap auto mate, racing mate. is well victorious. Done. Well, well done, done. Chas Mostert. Awesome, mate. You can do a burnout, do whatever you want with these tyres, but you've got to do it after the first turn and you've got to let the field go past you. Big victory for Chas Mostert. He's just clicked 25 years of age. He's home by 2.9 seconds over Mark Winterbottom. He won for Dick Johnson Racing back in 2013, Chas Mostert. He picked up another victory in 2015. He's got just a couple of corners to negotiate now before he picks up another win. He's got to make it mistake free into six. He can't afford a lock up. He's got a little cushion. It's 0.8 of a second. He's driven brilliantly this afternoon and he survived the Vodafone safety car intervention. Chaz Mostert squares her up on the exit of turn number six. Hooks a gear. The team stand and applaud. Chaz Mostert wins Queensland well done. Raceway. Great drive. Three quarters of a second from Scott McLaughlin. Shane Van Gisbergen on the podium for the second day running. He's been very fast. In fact, he's set the fastest lap of the race way back on lap 48, 21, 39. So all he needed to do now is clear the danger zone at turn 11. And he's done it nicely. He's allowing the gap to completely vanish, but there's a big battle here for third. Van Gisbergen throwing everything at Tim Slade to get to the podium. Up to the final corner now. Race number 21 of the championship. Prior to the weekend, he was never terribly comfortable at this location. He's never had a pole. He did that earlier. He's never had a podium. Now he's about to occupy the top spot. Chaz Mostert, winner, race number 21. 150 points. Come on. Yeah, baby. What a response from them, hey? They've really struggled through the course of the year, Neil, haven't we? We reported a lot of times, but for Moffat and Mostert today, absolutely superb. Beautiful drive, a lot of confidence. They completely reworked the setup on car number 55, and they were confident coming into this race. It's been a beautiful drive by Chaz Mostert, and 365 la a days later, Mostert has done what he did here last year and picks up a big victory. James Moffat jumps in first in the queue to say, well done. Big result.